Hey, I'm with Mike at Premier Pet Supply and we are talking about tear stains this morning. It's an issue that can affect both cats and dogs. Can you explain what it is? Sure. So the tear staining is kind of like an, an annoying nuisancey looking stain in mm -hmm. the eyes that can get pretty bad. It's either a red or a brown color. A lot of people with smaller dogs, with lighter color dogs have noticed this and there's a few things that could cause this. Okay. Uh, if it is a, a red color, it could just be the release of like iron, the breakdown of the red blood cells. Okay. Um, and then if it's brown, it's possible it could be a yeast infection. Both uh, are caused by the like uh, the um, overabundance of tears from forming. You know, some dogs and cats have a um, just produce too much, too right. many tears, and it comes out that way and stains the eyes. And this can be related to sinuses, right? Sure. So there's products out there that can help. For instance, by Homeopet, which is an all-natural, uh, what this does, it just prevents the sinuses from draining. Um, so if there's any type of like uh, nose drainage or mm -hmm. eye drainage, even ear infections, this is a product that could help that. But a lot of people don't realize that it helps really well with tear staining. How quickly could you potentially see results by using this product? Like any supplement, we always tell people, give it 30 days. But okay. it's possible to see results within seven to 10. And it's pretty dramatic when you look at some pictures before and after. I didn't realize how much diet played a role in this as well. Sure. Uh, this is a really interesting supplement, a bee pollen supplement. Bee pollen is one of those supplements that has many values to it, but one of the most important things that it does, it's an antifungal and it's an antibacterial. Okay. If it is a yeast infection, that's a fungus. So supplementing with a, just a tiny little teaspoon for a smaller dog once a day can really help to offset the tear stain issue. And you can just put it right on their food, right? Yes, you can add it right to the food. And that brings me to the stainless steel bowl, that actually could make a difference too. You know, feeding with a stainless steel bowl uh, as opposed to a plastic bowl that could potentially be uh, leaking some impurities mm -hmm. uh, is always better. It's cleaner, it's, it's, it's food grade, so it's um, more important to feed in a stainless okay. steel bowl than any. And just feeding a wholesome, well-balanced diet in general right. makes a big difference in offsetting tear stains. And this is a pretty unique product. Yeah, so the Honest Kitchen is one of the few, if if not and, um, uh, one of the only, that's mm -hmm. in, in entirely human grade. Oh, okay. So all the ingredients that go into are human grade. It's complete, it's well balanced. All you do is reconstitute it with water or goat's milk and it's a, it's a really great way to feed. It's like home cooked meal. So look into your dog or cat's sinus issues potentially, look into supplements and food and then even switch to a stainless steel bowl. All these things can definitely help offset tear stains. All right, thanks so much Thank Mike. You.